So on the CP practice final exam, question number 61 asks or directs you to write a Bronsted Lowry dissociation equation for hydrofluoric acid. 60 was Arrhenius. 61 is asking about how you do the same thing in the Bronsted Lowry theory. So in the Bronsted Lowry theory, when that hydrogen ion comes off, it has to go somewhere and attach itself to something. Okay? So what we do is, if we're just writing a dissociation equation and nothing else, then we're going to take that hydrogen off and attach it to a water molecule. Water molecules are in the solution. And so the hydrogen, now the red, remember the red marks here are not something you have to write. I'm just using this to illustrate what you do with it. The hydrogen ion is coming off of this formula. It's splitting up and it's joining up with water. Okay, and so on the other side, we don't have water anymore. We have H. 3 of because we have now, instead of two hydrogens, three of them. But since this hydrogen ion brought a plus charge to it, and the water was neutral, then the result has a plus charge. Okay, it's like this had a zero charge, and we're adding one to it, one plus. That makes this have a one plus charge. It is dissolved in water, so we call it aqueous. And since what we did was to split up hydrofluor hydrofluoric acid, then the fluoride ion is over here by itself. So this is the Bronsted-Lowry system. And this is the Arrhenius system up here. Now, I know this is not part of the question, but when you have an acid that dissociates in the Bronsted-Lowry theory, you also have a conjugate base. So you have an acid and a base. The acid is what gives away the proton. The base is what accepts the proton in the Bronsted-Lowry theory. This right here is the conjugate base of this, I'm sorry, this is the conjugate acid of this base. The conjugate acid is what you get when you add the proton to the base. And then this is the conjugate base of this acid. So whatever you, uh, whenever you remove a proton, what remains then over here, that's your conjugate base of that acid. 